So basically, this basically rounds it. So plus ten. So yeah, if we want, we'll put ten plus five. So minimum damage we can do is five, and maximum would be I think fifteen. Yeah. is especially useful if you're going to do, you know, put chance into your games, you know, etc. An RPG battle system, you know. Okay, the bolt. Now, we'll put a collision with the castle. Again, put code. We'll put other dot hp minus equals let's say 10 instance destroy you may think why is it other dot hp minus equals 10 why not this other dot hp is equal to minus 10 this basically this second line sets it like that's what it does it's telling that the other the HP you you change the variable okay this the second line sets it to minus 10 we don't want that that's why we put the minus before the equals to indicate that we want to actually take 10 away and not set it to minus 10 if you get what I'm saying so it's when uh, when it hits a castle it will it will deal some damage and destroy itself now open the castle object add event create and let's give it a HP. We'll mix. We'll make it um, thirty. Okay. So it will take about three hits before it's destroyed. Okay. Now, before we move on, we're gonna put some score system. I'll just give it no sprite. I'll put this as object as spawn. Alright. I'll make it another castle. Okay, in this castle, open castle. We're gonna another variable. See this variable HP, although any other all the other objects may have HP as well, this only occurs to this you know only variable and it gives it to any other object which has a name castle which so if I had multiple castles all the HP will be 30 and uh, they run from a different system compared to bad soldier which has a HP of like um, 30 again so we'll put um, yeah we'll put a variable global dot Points, point, point, zero. This is a variable which can be accessed by anyone. Well, basically, any object can access any other object, assuming you do, you know, like, um, you know, the name of the object dot variable is equal to blah blah blah. You know, so here we put global dot points is equal to zero. Now when the soldier dies, we're going to put global dot points plus equals one. So that whenever this guy dies, or before he dies, not only does he animate in a death, but he would actually, you know, whatever this is. He actually um, adds a point. Alright. Now. Now. Okay. We're going to. Before we do that. We want to program. Spawn. Which will be. Well. We can call it the bad castle. Now, if you put. Since they run through the same sprite. They'll look the same in the game, but 
with some you know effects or we can change it so add a draw event execute code 